everyone, it's Holly Schultz from babygizmo.com. Today I'm going to show you one way that you can combine craft time and snack time for the holidays with your kids. Here's what we're making today and I'm going to show you how. Candy cane snowmen, they're super easy and what I love about them is that the whole thing is edible and your kids can help you make them. So like I said, craft and snack all in one. So what you're going to need, you're going to need marshmallows. You want to get the regular size, the big marshmallows, not the huge campfire ones, but the normal size marshmallows. You're also going to need um, candy canes, candy canes like this. You'll need Hershey Kisses. You'll need M&M Minis for the holidays, the red and green ones. You're gonna need Twizzlers. And these, you need the ropes. You need the pull and peel ones because this is gonna be a scarf. And you're gonna need a little bit of black icing, a little bit of white icing. That's pretty much it. So let me show you how to do it. Super easy. So you get your marshmallows. Now you want to get the ones that look cute, right? I mean, you don't want the ones that are all squished. You take your candy cane and you break off the top. So break off the top. You can save these for, to eat later. Unwrap it. What I've done is then you have yourself a peppermint stick. Now you're going to put three of these marshmallows onto the peppermint stick. Now here's my tip and this is very important. Now you could try to push it through but it's going to squish your marshmallow. So what I do, <laughs> and this is a secret, I take a screwdriver. Now this is a totally clean screwdriver. It's been boiled. It is for baking. But take a screwdriver and I put it in hot water. Usually I put it under the sink but for the video's sake I warm it up so that it's nice and clean and then it's hot. And I'm going to take that screwdriver, you want the pointy one, the pointy screwdriver, and you're going to make a hole in the marshmallow. Because it's hot, it's going to melt right through. And that is going to make it much, much easier to get the candy cane through. You're going to do that with three different marshmallows. Warm it back up. I'm telling you, the screwdriver trick works wonders. Look at how easy that was. And then, since there's already a hole there, you push the marshmallow through, and then you're going to need one more. Like that. Okay, so there you got your body of your snowman. Then you're going to take a Hershey Kiss. We're going to do the hat. You could also do those holiday bell chocolates, um, any other kind of hat you want. Unwrap the Hershey Kiss. This is where your icing comes in because we use this as glue. This is, we're using Pillsbury today. Take a little bit, just you just want enough to glue the hat on. So take the icing, put a little bit of icing on the Hershey Kiss and stick it right on top. That's the hat. Then you're going to take, this is where these Twizzlers come in. Now I've already peeled them apart. You want to be careful peeling, peeling them apart because you just need one strand for each scarf. So you have yourself a Twizzler. Wrap it around the snowman's head and attach it however you think a scarf would look cutest. So however you want to do that, then you have yourself a scarf. Then you're going to want to do the buttons. Now this is where the red and green M&Ms come in. I take out the red ones, again a little bit more frosting. Take a little bit of frosting. Since the kids are doing this, it doesn't have to be perfect or anything. Take a little frosting and you're going to put one button, you're going to put three buttons, two buttons, whichever, you know, your kids prefer. You could do red and green if you wanted as well. So then do another one. You're just going to need like a little tiny bit of frosting just to get them to stick. Okay. Then you're going to put the nose on. So we got the buttons. Then we're going to put a nose on. You know what I use for a nose? I use... Reese's peanut butter minis. Those are the same things like M&M's, but they're Reese's peanut butter. Uh, the Reese's, and I cut them in half so that I have half of an orange nose. And I do the same thing. I put a little frosting on it and attach it where you would think a nose would go. So that's kind of like a carrot. Then we just have the eyes, and I use the black icing gel. This is one's by Cake Mate, and I just literally dab on two eyes and there you have a candy cane snowman you could get even more creative and put pretzel sticks as arms if you would like um, but I think he's just as cute this way so 
You could make them for craft time. You could make them for snack time. You could, even if, if you're having a play date, it's a really cute project. And see how easy it was? Very, very easy. You don't need a lot of stuff to do it. And then again, the kids can eat it and everything is edible. So you don't have to worry about sticks. You could use cake pop, cake pop sticks if you wanted, but I think the candy cane makes it. That's why it's called the candy cane snowman, right? So there you go. That is how to make a candy cane snowman. And like I said, different hat if you want. Um, I just think they're really cute and here, are the finished products like that. And so if you're having a holiday party with kids or you know maybe even adults, it's a really, really great way, you know, because it can also be decor if you propped them up into, you know, like a little snow scene. So there you go. I just wanted to show you how to make candy cane, um, candy cane snowmen today and how easy it was. And that's it for me. I'm Holly from babygizmo.com. Bye.